strolling down a busy road on a Sunday evening, a perfect setting to see someone brawl in a drunken rage? Imagine this happening in the middle of a jungle, and the drunk subject is a 250 kilogram silverback gorilla. You're watching Spamtastic, and here's your dose of horrifying real life incidents. A quiet, sunny, and regular nude at the forests of Rwanda's Volcanoes National Park saw a surprising incident that took the internet by storm. An allegedly drunk gorilla charged towards a group of photographers and punched Christopher Corteau, one of the wildlife photographers who said, normally, they timidly avoid visitors when they move close, but not this time. The one-sided brawl didn't end at a punch. The gorilla in full strength collided with the photographer that the impact of the collision felt like getting hit by a train. Then the gorilla just ignored him to chase back a black-backed gorilla who appeared threatening to Akarevuro, the alpha male of this silverback gorilla family. Christopher Cortel escaped the rather horrifying clash with some minor scratches. The photographer claimed that the gorillas get high on bamboos at this time of the year and their stomachs act as self-sustaining distilleries. The fermentation of bamboo inside the stomach gets gorillas intoxicated, but there's a catch. The mountain gorillas can't get high by eating bamboo or anything similar. Joanna Lambert, a professor in biological anthropology, confirmed that the biology of a mountain gorilla doesn't suggest it has a self-sustainable fermenting stomach. They just have a stomach like ours, humans. Bamboo could be fermented in the large intestine, but it can't make the gorilla drink as it's not the same fermentation as the one that makes us drunk. So, what could have driven the gorilla wild and aggressive? The professor suggests the gorilla could be on a sugar high because of the rich sugar content in bamboo that made him excited, but not drunk. The other logical reason can be the entrance of this photographer in the close proximity of the conservative gorilla family that drove Akaravuro into an aggressive mode to save his family from trespassers. What do you think could be the accurate reason for this epic clash? If you liked the video, just hit that like button and share if you want to spread this amazing story and subscribe for more awesome content. Also, comment down below for a chance to win an Oculus Quest 2. Until next time, survive the wild.